Starts with Peyton Graham, who leads things off as Wicklander's first pitch is swung on and hit deep to left field, and it just sneaks out of play. The 2-2. Well hit into right field for the Sooners' first base hit of the game. Surprise, surprise, Tyler Hartman has it. And at Oklahoma, here comes the 3-2, and McKenna takes ball four. And the Sooners have two on with two out. Well hit left center field. Coming in from center, Christian Franklin, and he ends. Last pitch by. That's down and a leadoff walk to Robert Moore. And that ball got Goodhart. Right on the hand, and he is not happy. And he's firm spot out there. There he is, and that's a little chopper. It's off the glove of Carmichael, who cannot make the play. And now the Hogs have him loaded. And that is heavy. In the right field. That scores one, and it's going to score two. As Slavens delivers, and it's 2 nothing. Whooping. Slavens has been one of the early surprises for Arkansas. Very productive right out of the jump. Two really aggressive swings right there. And this Arkansas offense, when they start to build momentum, boy, it really gets tricky trying to gather out. And that is hammered right center field. And the center fielder, Treadway, goes over and makes the... Wicklander walks Pettis, so OU's got one on for... Oma even better. And now, back-to-back -back walks for Wicklander. So what? Four pitches, four balls from Ramage. That ball hit into shallow right field, played by Robert Moore. And the Razorbacks avoid damage. That way as well. Yeah, that starting rotation, those three names you saw in the middle. Strike three called, and Carmichael's got it working here in the second. Eight consecutive strikes to start inning number two. Yeah. <laughs> Ground ball, shortstop. Zaragoza makes the play, and that was a one, two, three, second. Up to an even 500. And uh -oh. that is ripped into left field. And that is off of the wall, and he continues an absolutely torrid stretch. With a double. An older guy who's had a lot of the bats. And that ball is sent off the glove of battles. And McKenna going to stand over at first. And so Oklahoma's got its first scoring position for Kendall Pettis, who walked in the last inning. And Pettis sends that up the middle, and it may just tie the ball game as the throw from Franklin comes home. And it was close, but it is a 2 2 ball game tied with a Kendall Pettis single. First pitch breaking ball. Great job by Pettis staying in the middle of the field. That's tough to do. Now at a number 40, Freedom going to be eliminating the free passes is going to be critical. Now well, Daniel skies that to left. It looks like it's carrying and it's a problem and it's gone. Did not look like it when it left the bat, but it is a two-run shot for Braden Daniel, his first home run of the season. Four two Sooners. Well, this is our this is Oklahoma's kind of game right here. And Braden Daniel, you can throw the batting average out. This kid's really talented. He's strong, he's fast. Not a ton of play. Three for four with runners in scoring position. And that ball is ripped up the middle and into center field. And the Sooner sticks. Keep swinging. Zaragoza with a single. Slapped into center field. And a fifth Sooner run of inning number three crosses the plate. Zaragoza scores. And it's 5-2.
Peyton Graham's going to win that battle almost all the time. 3-2 fastball, center cut, too good of a hitter for him to be able to sit. Gray got it. He needed it. He ran back and he got it. Here for the Hogs, 2-2 to Franklin. He got him swinging, but it gets by Crooks. But he makes the play for the strikeout. There does he. And another strikeout. Honestly. <laughs> Put him on first. That's it. Oh, it's nice play, and they've got him picked off, but they lose him. Hardman was off of the bag, and with a bad throw to first, he advances to third. That ball well hit left field. Now it's going to be tough. Let's see. Gregory's throw. Oh, Hartman with enough speed to beat it. And the sacrifice fly is now a 6-2 sooner advantage. Ground ball. Diving attempt by Moore, but it sneaks past him and into center field. And that's the first hit of the night for Crooks. Right there. Where's Kelly Kapowski? Where's your, over, that, that's a, where's your oversized that's a cell phone? That's a layup. There's on. Treadaway, chopper, short, bobbled, misplayed. Battles can't make the play, and now they're loaded again. Well, he was fooled on it, but it goes to the backstop, and with that, it's 7 2. As Crooks crosses the plate. Worn out back there, without question tonight. Slider ripped into center field and down by Muniz. Throw to third is a good one from Franklin, but runner is safe. And Muniz with his first hit of the night for Oklahoma. Walked, homer, hit by pitch. In comes Battles, not an easy play, but he makes it. Didn't throw any harder than him. That ball well struck in a base hit. Into left, the third hit of the night for the Razorbacks getting interesting and Slavin sends that to right Goodbye. you might have been dead on roots about a breaking point eight four all of his swings tonight have been with the intent to do damage Gets a pitch up in the zone he can handle. No doubter off the wall. Slavens has been really impressive in the beginning of his Arkansas career. Ground ball through just between Smith and Battles in the left field. For a treadaway base hit his first of the night. He do up for the Hogs. That ball hit into left field and down. And now two on for OU with two outs in the eighth. For damage done by Oklahoma. Pettis, slow roller. Moore's got to hurry. Got him. That's uh -oh. well hit. Moore, right field. Eight five. so good for Godman in the first couple of pitches and Robert Moore changed it quickly. Fourth home run of the year. Yeah, Godman Moore. got him with the change up and then left one up and Robert Moore for as young as he is in his career, the pitches, the adjustments he makes pitch to pitch so impressive, so advanced and got him. The Las Vegas native taking care of business in Fayetteville, sure. The 0-2, strike three. Evan Taylor comes in and does exactly what they needed him to do. Checks a lot of boxes. Slavens leads off the ninth with an Arkansas single. He has had himself a night. Opitz, grounder first. They'll try for two and he throws it away. Arkansas in big time business right now in the ninth. 
Two on, nobody out. Two on, one out. Two down. Keeping the Hogs alive, but he can't. Jason Ruffcourt. Runes, I think we see why he's one of the top closers in all of the country. Yeah, I mean, Arkansas is every bit the number one team in the country, and this is a massive win for Oklahoma.